Lexus has all the right ingredients to build the perfect truck, bridging the gap between rugged utility and high-end luxury. Toyota, the parent company, produces pickups widely regarded for their durability and workhorse capacity. On the other hand, Lexus packs its big SUVs with advanced tech and premium materials. Given all this, it's a wonder why the company hasn't rolled out a truck yet. Is there market for luxury truck? Sure, there are some premium trucks out there, but they're not from premium brands. Ford packs its F-150 with a lot of advanced equipment, and the price is close to $100,000, but the company is not using Lincoln Badge. Same story with GM. Chevy and GMC pickups are out with high-end options and hefty prices, but the Cadillac truck is not coming back yet. Lexus continues to build sports cars that other brands have ditched. However, a pickup is not out, although it can share a lot of things with Toyota Tacoma or Tundra, and LX and GX SUVs. Truckers in the US aren't pinching pennies to upgrade their rigs. They drop serious cash on performance mods and parts that make towing easier. Premium gadgets are not a priority. Those who seek luxury features typically buy an SUV. So, truck makers pack existing non-premium pickups with advanced features, rather than develop and build a luxury model. Mercedes, the gold standard in luxury, tried to dip its toes into the truck scene. But, the X-Class was not a pure Mertz, it was basically a Nissan Navara with a few touches of German luxury. They quickly backed out, and that might be why Lexus and other premium automotive brands are hesitant. Lexus wants to launch a truck only when they know it will be a home run. Lexus is the most popular premium brand for SUVs in the US. The durability and luxury of the LX, GX, and other models are legendary. On the other hand, Toyota has a lot of success with the half-ton Tundra and mid-size Tacoma trucks. It all depends what the Lexus truck would be. As a big pickup, it can use the same engine configurations as Tundra or LX600. A 3.4-liter turbocharged six-pot unit can deliver up to 437 horsepower and 583 pound-feet of torque if the iForce Max system is deployed. Even the base setup seems quite impressive with 409 ponies and 479 pound-feet of torque. Then, imagine a Tundra decked out with all the luxury features of the LX600, leather seats, dual-screen infotainment, and heated and ventilated seats. Of course, the exterior will be inspired by Lexus vehicles, featuring a large grille up front. We can say the same if the truck is a mid-size model. In that case, the powertrain comes from the Tacoma. The base configuration delivers 278 horsepower from a 2.4-liter turbo 4 plant, while the upgraded model cracks out 326 ponies and 465 pound-feet of torque from a hybrid system. Here, the styling inspiration would be drawn from the RX. The idea of a Lexus pickup truck is not new. Fans have been discussing it on forums and social media for years. Most enthusiasts think it would just be a high-end Tundra, similar to the Capstone model. The main issue is the price, likely start north of $80,000. Plus, rolling up to a job site in a luxury truck might not be the best look. History hasn't been kind to premium trucks either. Lincoln's Blackwood and Mark LT barely moved 40,000 units combined, and most recently, the Mercedes X-Class was a flop. Truck enthusiasts tend to stick with the tried and true brands, like Toyota, Ford, Chevrolet. Most buyers would probably opt for a fully loaded Tundra, F-150, or Silverado over a Lexus, Lincoln, or Cadillac truck. A Toyota badge says you're a hard-working, down-to-earth kind of guy, while a Lexus badge, even on the same vehicle, can project the opposite image.